Hey kids, I hope you're having a good week. It's one of the last weeks of summer before school starts, so I hope you're really enjoying it. This week we're going to start a new unit of our lessons. So we learned about Jesus um, as the healer. He healed people um, who were sick. We learned about Jesus the teacher and some of his really famous teachings. Um, and this week, this month, we're going to learn about Jesus the miracle worker. Now, a miracle is something that's impossible to us. It's impossible to humans. We can't do it. We really can't even understand it because it doesn't seem like it should be able to happen. Um, but miracles are possible with God because we know that God is all powerful. And so this week you're going to learn about Jesus calming a storm. Jesus controlled the weather. I know, I don't know about you, but I wish I could control the weather. I would make it snow a lot because we never get snow in Arkansas and I love snow. Um, but yeah, Jesus, he calmed a storm. So what happened was him and his disciples were in a boat in the sea and Jesus actually fell asleep and a really bad storm came and the disciples were really scared. I know I've been in some pretty bad storms where I've gotten scared as well. And so the disciples went and woke up Jesus and, and were like, what are you doing? Um, you're just sleeping during this storm. And Jesus, it says he stopped the wind and he stopped the waves. He calmed the storm. And that's a miracle. That's something that the disciples were able to do. Me and you can't control the weather, but only God can. And when Jesus, when Jesus calmed this storm and he did this miracle, it showed his disciples that he is God, that he is not just human, but that he is fully God and is powerful and that he is in control. And that should be really encouraging us to us that God is in total control of everything. And at a time right now where, um, you know, this pandemic is here and things are a lot different, that should be an encouragement that God is still in control and that he has a plan. So as you learn more about this story with your parents, I just want you to remember that we can trust God because he is in control. Um, so kids, I hope you have a great week and I miss you. Bye guys.